Wendy Meads, and I'm going to show you how to do the Artemis Space Shuttle. Artemis is NASA's new lunar exploration program to study the moon in new and better ways and prepare for human missions to Mars. The supplies you need are dark paper, or you could use um, like dark blue or black, whatever you want your spacing to look like. Uh, I'm going to use oil pastels, but you can also use crayons. So go grab your supplies. Let's get creative. So let's start by drawing this first. I'm going to take an orange oil pastel, and I'm going to start with that. And you can kind of see that it's sort of more narrow at the top. So I'm going to try and do that. So, and I'm going to do it right near the top. I'm going to leave maybe three fingers for the very top with the white. And I'm going to start about here. I'm going to do a curve. And then I'm going to sort of do two lines like that and they're coming diagonal and then the rest I'm going to come down 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 probably to maybe about the center of the paper or a little bit further there's my center so I've come down a little bit with the orange okay and I'm gonna do a line so there's our the top of our spaceship. And now I'm going to take the white to do the top part. So you can see that there's a long sort of part and then it angles in, angles in, and we have the top part. In white, like that. And then we're gonna do the bottom. You can't really see the bottom of it, but we're gonna do uh, it's it white and we're going to angle it on either side angled lines and around like that okay and then we're going to do some jets in red we're going to just do like you can do it coming down and out so kind of like triangles and you can't see the ones on the other side but there's four Okay, so that looks pretty good. Now let's do these on the sides. Okay, so you can see that they come kind of part way down, this orange part. So I'm gonna start, I'm just gonna do a triangle on one side, triangle on the other, and try and keep them the same. And then I'm gonna come down and down down and down and then at the bottom I'm going to angle it again okay just like I did with this one and I'm going to add some uh, just one jet on each of those okay very fun now I'm going to color this all in I'm going to color with the orange and then I'm going to color with the white and then I'll do details in like black or other colors inside to decorate it. Okay, and then I'm gonna color in white all of these areas. Oh, the white looks so good against the dark. Yeah, if you don't have black paper, that's okay. You can be doing this on a, another piece of paper uh, you could do like a white piece of paper and then you wouldn't have to color in the white part so you just leave the part of the paper. Okay, and then I'm going to color this bottom part and the top. There we go. Great. There it is, and I'm gonna add some details. Now you can see here that there's curves. So I'm gonna do curves, and then I'll just space out. You can kind of decorate it the way you want to, if you want, but you can see there's kind of, I'll just hold it up. 
you can see there's kind of squiggly lines and um, other types of lines. So I might just do like some squiggles and then some sort of ones like this, squiggles and ones like this. So it's kind of looking similar. Okay. And then you can do, you can separate the orange and black. You can separate this part. And then I'm actually going to outline it in black. Even though it's black paper, it still looks good to outline it. Like so. So it all stands out. Because this oil pastel is a little darker than the paper so it really will look good there and the jets oh it looks super cool okay let's add in some of these details so you can see that there's like a this is a fuel um, rail so I might do that and you can see like there's a white line in here so let's do those I'm gonna do some lines that are different colors like that with the white it turns into orange and then maybe I'll do like a red thing here that's kind of like that and I think that's a lot quite a bit of detail maybe I'll do some like extra lines at the bottom there like so Looking good, looking good. Okay, very fun. Now we're going to do smoke coming down. So this is fun. We're going to just take our white like that first, okay? And then what we're going to do is we're going to do like all different levels of smoke. So we're going to do first white on the bottom like so. So I just did like a wiggly, wiggly, wiggly line and then I'm coloring it in and then I'm going to do yellow over top of that. We kind of want to blend the colors now and get different colors. So I'm going to blend the yellow into the white. Okay, and you can make it kind of scribbly like so okay and then I'm gonna do orange as a layer yeah like so or you don't want to go over where those jets are okay and then I'm gonna do red so we kind of did all the warm colors and then I'm gonna make it look more like smoke by kind of doing like a wiggly line Okay, and you can do it like where you're doing this, the wiggles in, and then it sort of blends into that other one. And you can kind of circle it like you think smoke would be like. I feel like this one needs to be way more dark. And then I'm going to show you a little trick. Okay, fun. Woo, that looks so good. Make sure all the paper is covered up. And of course, you can do this on a regular piece of paper too, if you don't have a dark one. Uh, you can do the smoke like this. Okay, now watch this. We're gonna do, we're gonna start here, and we're gonna do wiggle, 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 all the way into the white, like that. So it looks like it's smoke coming out. Wiggle, 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 all the way down into the white. Ooh, it looks so good. And then we'll go over these parts. Press hard into these parts so that it really shows up. And you can tell. Just be careful because your white might get a little dirty as you're going over those other colors. Okay, now take a look and make sure you're happy with what it looks like. Ooh, super fun. Okay. All done with the spaceship. So you really don't need to add too much more into this, except I'm going to just do dots of white.
four stars. Just like that. And look, you don't need to do too much more, really. That looks super fun. We got stars, we got a spaceship that's moving, take it off, and we have a really cool smoke on the bottom there. I hope you enjoyed making Artemis. This lesson is part of space art that's inside of the Art Club classroom. You can do all kinds of different uh, art related to space. Click the link in the description. I can't wait to create with you.